What you're about to see is what it's like to drive in a KTEC powered C7 Z06 on the track. I'm at the speed ring at M1 Concourse doing a toge battle. A toge battle is a one-on-one -on -one timed competition between two cars. It consists of an out lap, a hot lap, then you switch, do another hot lap, and then a cool down. The object when you're the lead car is to create as large a gap as possible. When you're the chase car, the object is to close the gap. All right, line it up for the toge battle, starting through turn one, slow through turn one in second gear, and you're hard on the power through one and two, up the hill for turn three, crossing the start-finish line. Lining up for turn three, hard on the brakes, turn in, apex on your left, wind it all the way out to the right, short straight here between three and four, and your quick apex on the left, and wind it back out to the right as you squeeze the throttle for the medium length straight, heading towards the hairpin. Turn five's a kink, straighten out the kink, and hard in the braking zone for the diamond line, being off turn six, Slow speed here, apex tight on your right, and you're hard on the power. Squeeze that throttle, and you're hard on the power through second, third, and fourth gear here, up to 134 miles an hour. Look for the braking zone, braking about the four, hard on the brakes, down into three. Late apex for turn seven, outside all the way to the inside, late apex, wind it back out to the left, and you're up the hill for the kink through turn eight. Power up the hill, don't lift. Hard on the brakes for nine, use all the track on the right, quick apex on the left, wind it back to the right and quickly to the left, set up for 10A. Apex on your right for 10A, wind it all the way out to the left as your maintenance throttle through here. As you get to the apex of 10B, squeeze on the power, quick wide open throttle and then you're hard on the brakes for turn one. Turn in, get it pointed in through turn one on the apex on the right, apex on the left for turn two, hard on the power up the hill towards three through the finish line. Now we've switched positions for the second half of the toge battle. We'll walk you through what it's like doing a toge battle. This is a one shot. You have one chance to run your fastest lap you can. You can't make any mistakes. Four off and you're disqualified. It's such a tight competition that any other small mistake will cost you the lap. You gotta go really fast, but not too fast to make a mistake. Here we're chasing Chad Slag and his Honda Civic down the back straight. Big power difference here, so we're catching them pretty quickly. And before you know it, we've caught up to them in turn seven. So we're in a KTEC Stage 4 Z06 with 860 horsepower on an E85. We've got the downforce from the tick wing and tick splitter, as well as some other KTEC carbon fiber aero parts. Putting the power down to the ground is a DSC Sport suspension system with DSC Sport controller and Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2 tires based on the rules in the track mod class. The wheels are forged KTEC KT1 wheels by Forge Line. Air flows into the engine through a Haltec air intake system and out through Cook's headers and Corsa exhaust. I was racing in Sport 1 here. Active handling was starting to intervene. I'm starting to go fast enough in the car that uh, beyond the point of using active handling, so probably to go any faster in this car, going to have to turn off active handling and go to Sport 2. During qualifying I was running 111s and then 110s consistently. This is the first round of the bracket battle. I moved on from the first round to face a pro time attack driver in the second round and lost by two tenths of a second. It was one of the closest battles of the day, and I ran my fastest time ever at M1 Concourse of a 109.5. I'm Jason Harding, Director of Aftermarket Operations for KTEC, and I race what I sell because it's the best, and that's KTEC.